Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, RivetWiz here. So today I'm just going to show you how to create these view filters and from these view filters how to create this legend for us and then using a Dynamo player. So please stay tuned. Okay, let me show you how to create the legend from view filters. So firstly, you're going to want to set up your filter. So you press VV on your keyboard for visibility graphics. Then you go to filters. You go edit the new. And here we go new. So now I'm going to set up a filter for the foundation. So I know my foundation sizes. So you can name this whatever you'd like, but I prefer giving it the same name as the actual size of the base so now i'm going to go to structural foundation because that's the category it's under then here i go to type name and i want it to be equals to and here pops up all the different foundations that we have so i want this one so we just say apply then i'm going to duplicate this because we have more than one base I'm going to duplicate it maybe four times or three times then here I'm going to go to the one by one by 900 can't actually remember which ones were done and which ones weren't but let's do all of them then I say apply just to make sure the changes are saved. Then we're going to do this one. Rename. One eight hundred by two hundred. There we have that one. Apply. And then we can do this one. Just going to copy that name. It's just quicker. Paste. Let's duplicate it one more time. Just apply so that we make sure we save our changes. This one we want 2 meter by 2 meter. Rename. There we go. Apply and OK. Then we go to add. We want to add all of those. So I click at the top. I press shift on my keyboard and I click at the bottom of the bases. And I say OK. And now we've loaded in all of them. I do the same here. Click at the top. Then at the bottom. And I want to do a pattern. I'm just going to make it solid. And give it a green color. But now obviously it's going to change all of the colors. Or all of the bases to the same color. Now I'm just going to go and edit the colors that I want for each base. It doesn't matter which color you choose. As long as it represents a different color for a different size base. So let's make this one purple. And then the last one. Let's make it maybe red. Okay. Then if we say apply, you can see that the base is actually changed to the colors. So we did not set up. A base size for this one but that's okay let's just change it to another by base size just for illustration purposes so currently we have one two three four different colors so we're missing missing the orange color which is that one so let's just make a meter by meter base just to show you that one will turn orange that's actually a pile so let's just disregard that one let's just remove that that's fine we just have those four bases i'm just gonna make this one purple okay so now i'm going to create a legend here so let's go and right click we say new legend you can call it whatever you'd like, but I'm just going to say legend and in brackets, 
foundation. Now it gives us a blank page, which is fine. So now what we want to do is we want to actually insert and load the family, which is part of the package that you are going to download. So this legend filter name is what you want to import into your drawing. So you just say open and it loads it into the drawing. And then what we're going to do is go to manage dynamo player then you need to go and find this specific legend from from view filters where you actually saved it how you do that you just click here on add folder and you go by this plus to add the folder and you can go and search for that folder and you just say okay to add it then we're going to click on this now we're going to go to select empty legend view that would be the legend that we've just created now so we're just going to search for it obviously under l for legend but it seems to take a while to actually pick it up here so in the meanwhile let's just go to select view filters so we've set up these filters in our zero zero foundation layout which is that one at the top let's just see if we can find the legend one now so after a while it's actually come up here legend in brackets foundation so just give it a, a moment to actually load then you just say run and there it generates <coughs> apologies there it generates your legend for you color coded so then what you can do is go to your sheet so there's your sheet we can see that this is color coded then we're going to go to this legend bring it into your drawing just paste it somewhere there so now you can change this to whatever you'd like or you can maybe just say no title click inside here copy that text Or rather make it new text dx and type in here legend and underline just bring that down a bit like this you can obviously make the text bigger how you'd like and um, that's how you create your legend from view filters so if you want to get your hands on this dynamo script please click on the link in the description and it will take you to the page and thank you guys for all your support please like and subscribe and i'll see you next time